Alright, so we're back with Armored Warfare again at 2.18 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, don't know why I'm recording like this, but, you know, whatever. Um, one thing I have to say, I don't think I'm going to do any more uh, Seven Days to Die. I have a video recorded and it's uploaded. I'm waiting for... I'm trying to see if I want to release it or not. But, um, I'm just not having fun with the game. I mean, here and there it's kind of fun, but uh, some things just annoy me and... You know, I don't really like that style of game. I mean, I tried, you know, Seven Days to Die, I've tried Nether, I've tried, um, well, it was originally called The War Z, then they changed their name to Infestation Survivor Stories because of copyright reasons. That game was just terrible. There was loot every, every it was neat because there was loot everywhere and you always had a gun. There was no way not to have a gun, but zombies took forever to kill. There were so many of them, players were all Russian, and if you were... American, they'd ins instantly kill you. You know, I did have a... I, I didn't record it. Me and my friend played it. And it, it just runs horribly also. So, yeah. I don't buy that game. Um, what else? Oop, hold on one second. Sorry about that. My ear itched from wearing these headsets. I've been wearing these headsets for a long time today because I was watching uh, one of my favorite YouTubers. They were doing a, a Demon Souls stream. Uh, their channel called The Switcher. Uh, if you know them from their machinima videos, they're called, like, Two Best Friends Play. A great channel, just funny. Highly recommend them. Um, they started streaming. They streamed Demon Souls today, and they're gonna maybe do more streaming on Twitch. Not sure how I feel about streaming. I think it's neat. You need a good internet to do it, though. Um, yeah, back to open world survival. Open world kind of survival games. I'm not opposed to doing them in the future. I just have to find one I like. I think the problem is because I think the problem is I have is mainly the premise because most of them you just start out with nothing and you're supposed to build your way up to amazingness. And I don't like that. I'd rather start in the middle. It's sort of like Fallout. Like Fallout you don't really start with nothing. I mean, you start in, in a jumpsuit, usually, uh, you can f and then you have a 10 millimeter pistol. And, you know, bang. That, that's, that 10 millimeter pistol is, so once fully upgraded, it's a great weapon. Now, um, uh, some games I was interested in that are open world, um, that are, that are coming out this year. Uh, the new Far Cry may like the primeval or something, or I don't know. It's like cavemen. It's like f it's like cavemen. You're playing as a caveman and during a uh, ice age, the ice age area, which I, just, I forget what that scientific name is. For some reason I went to, wanted to say the Permian, but the Permian's before the dinosaurs. Um, yeah, uh, which looks cool. Definitely looks cool. And then also, um, Tom Clancy's The Division looks really good. And I'm mainly interested in it because of the detail and the weapons there. Because Tom Clancy always has great detail in the weapons in all of his games. Because, um, I, I mean, I haven't played too many of them. I only played Rainbow Six Vegas 2 and uh, Rainbow Six Vegas and Rainbow Six Vegas 2. And they were they were great fun. But yeah, I might get the Division. That looks like a cool game. Not sure what else I had yet for triple A games. I mean there's some indie games I might want, but I need I need to play the games I have more. Right now I'm just really playing Army Warfare and that's to make videos. So yeah, let's get try to get into a BMP three game. Need to definitely unlock the engine and this and the augmented optics mark three. Definitely a must on this vehicle. Let's skip this. Alright. It's your seven game. Ooh, lots of challengers. No, no, not really that much challenger one over there. <laughs> I mean, it is two twenty some a.m. So, uh. 
No, I did go out to dinner t today. That pretty good sandwich. It was, um, Foster House. We went there. Mm -hmm. Pennsylvania. We have these special Driver types of sandwiches Affirmative. that, um, Gunner, scan for target. Affirmative. Driver, move out. Ammo up. That, um, basically, like, well, I got the, the burger, but they they put the burger, fries, coleslaw, like heap of coleslaw, big like a handful of coleslaw, tomato, and on big thick pieces of bread. I mean, I get mine without the coleslaw because uh, it's the mayonnaise, coleslaw, gives me stomach aches. But yeah, it's pretty good. I'm gonna be there's a BMB 4 you can probably scout the entire map. Well oh, now 500, one third the map there. No. A little over one third. I have to ask down in the comments, do you prefer fractions or decimals? I, I, I honestly think fractions are easier for you to understand than decimals. Like, I, uh, it might be because yeah, in the imperial system you use a lot more fractions, like 916s. 732s. Where is it? Uh, metric. I, I don't hear, you know, 5 tenths. No, 5 tenths is a half. 5 sixteenths. A metric. 5 sixteenths millimeter. side of that it's a one there you go Ooh, Bradley over there yay nine damage we could really use some help Come back, let me hit you with a hundred millimeter. Oh, he's dead. Alright, game just said have you right there. She could zoom in more. Oh, this 100 millimeter, so not worth it. Pop up, inconsistent damage. I yeah, got the trees like spring. Do you see that? Really wish this arrow would actually protect me and stuff, but you know, nobody fires heat, so Well, hit me. 
Yeah, that was never gonna work. MP3, just too easy to hit. Not enough camo, not enough firepower. <laughs> it's getting a buff. They Soundsucker said that they're gonna give it a buff. Which, it, it needs a P range buff, it needs a camo buff, it needs a rate of fire buff. Needs to be able to fire its missiles on the move, like it can in real life. The BMP, yeah, the BMP 3 I mean, series vehicles can fire and guide its missile on the move. Not at top speed, but. Well, it can guide it while going slow at least. I don't think we did that bad. I mean, it's definitely shooting people that game. Reactor is one of my favorite maps. I mean, it's not great, but. Once they open up, once they add in letting vehicles be amphibious to the game, you can actually be able to use this waterway and this waterway. Yeah, it will add so much. Look at that. It's the fox. It's, this is why missiles are useless. Because you fire the missile, you get spotted, you die. It Missiles are not useful. They're just not useful. Especially at higher tiers. I mean, yeah, tier, f tier 4 and 5 are where they're useful. Beyond that, they're kind of useless. I mean, this is from the Terminator, but that's only because the Terminator has armor. How'd we do? Okay. Pretty crappy. 400 some damage. Good to get 1000 XP, though. Six thousand more experience to get that upgrade engine. Not that's gonna do much, right? Yeah, that's yeah, pretty good upgrade. Skip. All right, another game with actually the exact same people from last game in it, just on different teams. That challenge, yeah, because that challenger one was on the enemy team last time. So was that BMD four, and I believe everyone else is. die real quick, so, because they're BBLs. But you never know. Sanjero, you're dead. That's why you don't push up on the Sanjero. Why am I still spotted? See, this is why I hate. BMD just doesn't have enough spotting range. Like, I, why can't I see if that guy's shooting at me? Right over him, thank you game. This is what I wanted. Identify target. Hostile PC. Yeah, 
Yeah, that would have killed that BMD4, but yeah, the game, even with 10% RNG, still is way too much for me. Hmm. That BBL. It's killing me. And just focusing on me, which is never fun. You get a good hit with that, uh, 100mm on that on BMD4, though. But, too bad the second one missed for no reason. I mean, I had perfect shot at his turret. That was gonna happen, sir. Come on, some hero. Eh. Target locked on. I like how you can lock on people through walls. I think that's funny. Hey, look, that, that, it's right through him. Through a wall. Target locked. I my target. Hostile truck. Target locked on. Ooh, target that locked. velocity. That's a problem. Target locked. fire. Thank you, game, for giving me 60-some damage when it should've... If, if I would've penned him, which it should've penned him, for some reason the era protected him for no reason. Despite my era not protecting me for any such crap. Except for that one ATGM. Two fires and ATGM at an AFE. Oh, we lost that one. That's another loss. Gotta love all these losses because BMD4 or BMP BMP3 cannot scout. Doesn't have enough view range. Doesn't have enough. Doesn't have nearly enough camouflage it needs. Doesn't have enough fire rate. Doesn't have enough speed. Doesn't have enough armor. It has nothing. Nothing. Why am I playing it? Cause. Why not? So how do we do? I did 13 damage. Another thousand experience. Second most on the team in terms of damage. Still, it's like. <laughs> it has a super slow turret traverse. Look, here's what needs to happen. 
I explained this in a couple of videos. This needs to be lowered. Rate of fire on the 100 millimeter needs to be regularly. This is eight seconds. I got it down to 7.20 seconds. It it needs to be standard six seconds. And then with um retrofits, maybe get you can get it down to maybe four. 475. You might think, whoa, that's way too fast the fire rate. No, it's not. Not c because this because this vehicle did does inconsistent damages. You need to shoot it a lot because you're never going to do the right amount of damage. And you're only going to do the good damage to lower armored vehicles. And that's not, and that, and as you see, it's not a guaranteed. So, yeah. The auto cannon on this thing is useless because the turret doesn't turn fast enough in order to keep up with the auto cannon's rate of fire in order to lead people. So yeah, another thing is the view range. Here's the view range on the BMP2, which has which is a tier lower, the same vehicle tier lower, with the same basically the same crew, the same retrofits for vision. I have 40 more. That's not, that's with an upgrade retro. That's with the commander. With retrofits. It, it needs buffs, and I can't even imagine going on to the BMP 3M. Like, like where is it? I need the details page. Look at how low the view range is on it. 435. Oof. That's only a hundred more meters. That's, that's less than... That's like only 30... Only, uh, how much else is that? What, 435? 435 compared to 375. So that'd be 30... Six, that's 60... It's only 60 more meters in it than an Abrams. What? Uh, it's an, yeah, it's a tier 9 Abrams, but that still doesn't make any sense. Oh, well, it has more view range than it. It's true, but yeah, it's gonna be it. It's two, it's a couple losses, but, you know, what are you gonna do? You get bad teams, you get bad teams.